Hey, what's up, guys? It's Zeronix GFX, and today I'm going to be bringing you another tutorial, and this is basically a plus 500 shatter tutorial. So what you're going to do is click on Project. You're going to go to you're going to press Control I, or you can go to File Import, and then find your file. But I'm just going to use MW2 Helipad. All right, and you're just going to drag this on to your composition. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to create. Go to up to Composition. Go to New Composition and name it plus 500 or you can name it shatter or whatever make sure the settings are the same as this main composition down here frame rate width and height and everything now what you're gonna do after you've done that is you're gonna just type in you're gonna click and type in uh, plus 500 now, I don't know why mine's all weird but you're gonna go to font and you're gonna find uh, it's like bank gothic yeah right here bank gothic medium bold type I guess is what it means but I don't know alright once you've done that you can double click on it to highlight it and you're gonna make it like a yellowish like a dark kind of yellow color like that alright and after you've done that what you're gonna do is you're just gonna adjust the size a little bit just make it a little bit taller now you're gonna come into MW2 helipad and you're gonna drag this plus 500 composition right over top so you can see it pops up right there now also what you're gonna find is the spot where the plus 500 actually comes up so you can see mine's right there so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press shift F1 and that's gonna put a marker right here showing where it pops up now in my plus 500 composition make sure you're not scaling this one down and doing weird stuff make sure you're in the actual composition before you scale stuff otherwise it will mess up and it won't look good so just remember that I'm just going to make it a little smaller and kind of move it over until it's basically lined up with this other one right here. Alright, that looks pretty much good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually make it a little bit more yellowish. Oops. Yeah, I'm going to make it a little bit more yellowish just so it kind of looks... Yeah, that looks good. Alright, so now we've got that all lined up. What we're going to do is we're going to click on the plus 500... Uh, composition you're gonna come over to here type in glow and you're just gonna drag glow or star glow doesn't matter you're gonna drag glow on there and you're also gonna type in CC pixel poly all right and you can see it pops up right here and you're gonna drag that onto your uh, composition as well and apparently it already went make sure the pixel poly is above the glow by the way um yeah anyway what you're gonna do is where the plus 500 pops up you're gonna make sure that the beginning of the composition is right there because you can see this shatter happens right at the very beginning so you're just gonna make gonna wanna make sure of that now in the CC pixel poly settings these are these are my settings I set the force to 350 the gravity to 1.5 or you can keep it at 1 it doesn't really matter direction randomness to 25 speed randomness to 20 and grid spacing down to 15 now what grid spacing does is you can see that when this shatters there's a whole bunch of little pieces if I bring this up to let's say 75 it just makes less of those pieces so this is basically based off of pure I guess choice or um, preference personal preference um, but this is just personally what I use um, so you can see that it's right when the 500 pops up it shatters and it makes a cool little effect so what I'm gonna do actually right now is I'm just gonna import I'm gonna go to project and I'm gonna import um, a little gra glass break real quick just to kind of enhance the effect for you guys so you can see what goes on alright part six sound effects uh, agony sound effects possibly no oh it's just in here it should be yeah here it is it's right there glass break WAV and I'm gonna drag this right to where it actually breaks so right there and then I'll do a quick little ram preview for you guys so you guys can kinda see what's going on alright so let's see and then also I'm just gonna look at the levels on this so I can see that it start shattering right where it actually pops so just do one more quick RAM preview for you guys so you can actually see 
Alright, so that's Alright, so that's just a cool little effect you can use in your OCEs or anything like that, even episodes. It's very simple to do, doesn't take very much time, and it it looks pretty sick. So after you've added your color correction and everything over the top over top of it, it'll look really sick for you guys. So leave a like, possibly comment, and please subscribe to my channel. And uh, leave a comment also saying uh, what tutorial I should do next. I'm taking in pretty much any requests. Um, so just leave a comment. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.